Hello friends, today I am going to teach you the super soft and yummy strawberry swiss roll. So read out the ingredients first. Kindly note it down. First of all you have to separate the egg white and egg yellow in different bowls. I have taken 4 medium sized eggs and it's always better to keep the eggs in fridge before separating. It's easy to separate the egg white if you keep the eggs in fridge. Let's take it out and separate the egg white. Now add a pinch of salt into egg white and start the beater at full speed till the egg white becomes stiff. Once the egg white becomes stiff, start beating your egg yolk, add half a cup of sugar and vanilla essence into it and beat it at full speed. Now add 2 tablespoons of refined oil and beat this egg yellow again for a minute. Now add maida and the baking powder into the egg yellow mixture. Everything I am adding into the yellow mixture only. And now you fold this mixture gently with the rubber spatula. into the egg yellow mixture in batches and fold it with very light hands. Make sure that the froth of the egg white remain intact while folding. Your mixture should look very light and fluffy. This is the beauty of uh, Swiss roll that the egg white and yellow mixture should be very light. Now spread the batter on a baking tray lined with parchment paper. Remember you only have to use parchment paper. Spread the batter all over. Make sure that the batter spreads the tray evenly. Now bake it for 15 to 20 minutes. Check it with the toothpick. And now sprinkle the powdered sugar all over the cake while it's hot and start folding the cake from one side. Remove the parchment paper slowly and start rolling the cake. You have to roll it when the cake is hot. 
and don't over bake the cake otherwise you will not be able to fold it now wrap the cake roll with the same parchment paper and keep it at room temperature for an hour now after an hour open the roll slowly and spread the filling of your choice evenly all over the cake you can do any kind of filling i have used strawberry crush you can use any filling of your choice if you don't have any filling you can use the jam you can use orange crush mango crush anything of your choice if you want you can spread whipped cream or cream cheese also over this strawberry crush now start rolling the swiss roll from the same end and this time roll it tight cover the roll again with the same parchment paper and cover the sides too and now keep it in fridge for overnight now take it out from fridge after 8 to 9 hours remove the parchment paper and cut the swiss rolls into small pieces with serrated knife so that's how we make the super soft swiss rolls enjoy your swiss rolls thanks for watching